Miss Shelley, here we are at Unit 2B at the Horizon Condo. This is the view from the deck. You can see the Overcoat Inlet there, Fort Smith Island, jetties. You can see down on your neighbors below. relatively new. As we discussed, they're going to do potentially new siding. This is a Rhino liner type deck. It looks like it's been patched multiple times. Since it's on the exterior, I would think that that belongs to the community to take care of, but I'm, you know, we'd have to double check that. It's an absolutely gorgeous view. It's a beautiful day. in. So you have tile floor here throughout. Just do a quick scan. There's a gas fireplace. Wood clad Pella windows. Look to be in good shape. A little bit of water staining down there along the baseboard, but it doesn't look to be active. Probably old. There's the loft upstairs and the stairway going up to the loft. Furniture's in decent shape. They are running the um, stove right now, doing the deep clean on the stove, so that's the noise you might hear. There's a nice storage closet under the stairs here. Washer dryer right here. Nice little laundry area. That's the front door. So as you come in the front door, the hallway back to the bedroom is to your right. And then the washer dryer is right here next to the kitchen. Kitchen area is small, open. Oven's definitely in self-clean mode. Cabinetry is a little, you know, it's older. This cabinet's a little off its hinge there a little bit, but it's, uh, everything functions. If you did want to redo it, it wouldn't take much to redo, but right now everything looks nice. Appliances look, at least the dryer looks newer. Everything, the microwave looks newer. Let's walk on down the hallway here. Looks like this is the bathroom to for guests as well as the master. So we have one big giant wall of mirror here, two sinks. Soaking tub, commode is hidden there behind the door. Shower stall, all in one sort of very tiny shower stall. Big giant tub with more mirrors. And then you have a bedroom here. Looks like a couple of closets. Doors off its track. So, Again, this is something that we see commonly with sliders. You have some water damage there on this slider. The door works nicely. We have a little deck out here. Again, look at the roof. That's my car down there in the parking spaces. You do have covered parking. This does have a garage. You can see again they talked about replacing this siding. Door exterior. 
looks okay. You can see. And the door slides nicely. A great view over to that lighthouse. And a view into town. Great location. Love the location of this place. Almost all the way to the end of the street. Beautiful spot on Silver Lake Drive. Bedroom has carpeting, few spots, but really a lovely big giant room. And then back down the hall. There goes the ferry just leaving. I don't know if you can see that, but they just pulled out the Cedar Island Swan Quarter Ferry Division. Go up the stairs here to the loft. Ceiling uh, has some popcorn on it, some not. Carpet. They have a bed in this loft space. So legally this is a two bedroom condo, but they have put a bed in here. More, there's your HVAC and more owner's closet space here. That one is a locked closet, I'm guessing the same size. And then you have the bedroom up top here. And ceiling looks to be in good condition. It's a great feeling space. This whole unit has a nice, really nice feel to it. Nice telescope in this huge closet. So plenty of storage inside the unit. This one's locked, I guess, again, assuming that it's the same size. And then you have a bathroom up here. Both bathrooms have sheet vinyl on the flooring. And then you got another nice big mirror. The little shower stall thingy in the corner here. Let's see. Nope, no light. There we go. Perfect. And then you have the big giant tub with the mirror. And you can see, you know, the spaces down there where the water's splashed over the side of the tub. Not unusual. This is a king size bed up top here. Both bedrooms are just really big. The whole place is just really comfortable. I do see some signs that wind has pushed moisture around those windows at some point. That probably will be solved when they reside because they will have to recaulk outside. But yeah, this is lots of space in here. Lots of open, airy light. I don't have any of the lights on, and it is very bright. And here, I'll take you. Oh, here's your neighbor. This is the stairway up. So, your first floor neighbor there. Parking space for B2. Right here, nice big deep parking space. There are multiple closets over there, so I'm wondering if one of those belongs to this unit. We would have to ask specifically about that because it does seem like that would be the fair thing. Meters. Probably the septic system there.
HVAC units. Don't know if they're, I don't see any kind of marking on them as to which one is which. The majority of them look to be fairly new. Some extra shingles down there. like the dock. yard here. And plenty of parking. Extra parking. Alright. Let me know if you have any questions.